we're being limited as a black community by what we think the avenues of expression. Like you think about, oh, I'm an artist. People are gonna think you're a rapper or like you produce beats or something like that. But yo, there's way more avenues to express your creativity. My name is Jory Brown. I graduated from environmental design in 2013. I had bounced around from a different, couple of different schools. I was running track at uh, the University of Wisconsin, like Whitewater. Things happened and uh, I got expelled. And like through that like bad situation, it allowed me to be like, oh, well, now I have the opportunity to explore. Like maybe I can do something creative. Then I went to a community college, then I went to the Illinois Institute of Art, and I remember there was this kid in one of these classes and he had this book. And I was just like, yo, what are you looking at? And then it was just all of these drawings of just like characters, just like little environments, basically a development of just an idea and like a story. And I was like, yo, what is, like, is this, this is a book, where'd you get it? He's like, oh, it's downstairs in the student store. Yo, so I ran, like ran down, that sounds whack, but I actually did run. Um, I ran to the store, got it, and then I was just like consuming this book for like two weeks straight, over and over and over. And then at the end, it was like, oh, this is student work from a school called Art Center College of Design. And I was like, yo, this is student work. I can't believe this. So I flew to San Francisco where my brother was living at the time. And then we drove all the way down to Art Center. And you come up through the hills and then you go on campus and it's like the student work is phenomenal. And I remember I was like, I was actually on the bridge looking towards the mountain. And I told my brother, yo, I'm about to go to the school to watch. And he's like, all right, we'll see. But my first impression was like, man, this is just kind of unreal. <sighs> I think one. I think, I think it was just Eni. That's how, actually, that's, yeah, it was. It was just Eni, because that was how me and him became homies. You know, I remember going down the stairs, and I was like, yo, who's this tall black dude? I'm like, he seems cool. And there's no other black people on campus, so I was like, yo, what up? He was like, what up? So it was just me and him. I love all of my teachers, by the way, but I'm gonna say it wasn't a design class. It was um, History and Theory of Space with Ali Moderes. That class kind of makes you more introspective and think about it in like a philosophical way. So that was like the most influential class. If you picture a circle, right? And it's like, if the black people only represent like a sliver of that circle, that's not a good enough voice. I think the solution starts in the black community before it gets to Art Center. The more voices you have to be heard represent like a more diverse people, that's better.